it's playtime folks i'm gonna go and put into the elevator some of the stuff that i have in my bags so that's 500 there i've got to make, figure out how to make those project part three and i've got to figure out how to make the versatile framework looks like the versatile framework is made uh, produced in an assembler i don't recognize that part that i need 12 of hmm so i gotta figure out what that part is and that equals one scaffolding. This one, automated wiring, but okay. It's not telling me how to make it. Let's go ahead and go back. And the next level is advanced steel production, okay. There's where I can make my automated wiring and I get the minor mark two at that point. Okay, I can make the heavy modular frame, a stator, a motor, and a automatic wiring, that's cool encased industrial beams hmm, that's interesting okay and i need i'm going to select the milestone so i can put it up there i need what are those steel pipes okay and i need rot rotors wiring and i've got plenty of wiring laying around don't i and i've got plenty of cement already so i'm going to select that milestone and okay very good so wiring is right there. And this is what, come on, tell me what that is. That's the rotors. And I don't have any, yeah, I have 50 rotors at this point. Okay, need more rotors. Steel pipe, that's pipe. Okay, is that steel pipe's just made out of three, is that iron? That's where I disconnected it. So, and I'm gonna check something here. Okay. My consumption right now is, wow, my consumption is here. That's fine. My max consumption, if everything was running, is, is the blue line. And my production is above it and my max capacity is, is above it. Okay. But boy, they're, they're, they're way close, aren't they? Okay. <clears throat> well, that's basically telling me that my, uh, well, my max, product, ma max consumption is right here with all my machines running. If they were running 100%, they'd be clear up here. What I'm really produce, using is down here, which that's because I've got a lot of unbalanced equipment. Float over that. That is a a steel ingot, which is made from smelted with coal, produced in a foundry. Okay. Okay. So first off, I need to find a convenient coal place. What does it take to make a foundry? Okay. I need. In order to make a foundry, I've got to have some of those. And so I need to have some more of those. And I, I think I just need to go crafting them. That will only give me 12. Okay. Foundry needs 16 of them, 110 rotors, and plenty, of, and I've got plenty of concrete. All right, my bags are packed, hopefully. Hopefully I'm learning to drive this thing a little bit better.
I obviously have to get off the machine in order to use the scanner. And I am scanning for coal. I want to find a coal power plant up north. Okay. There's one. 886 meters that direction. Whoa, 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 whoa. Back up. Okay. Okay. Okay, let's exit the vehicle and do my scan again for coal. Four hundred and seventy-two meters straight ahead. Okay. Okay. Um, I think that means I need to go around this direction. I sure wish I could drive easier. All right, let's drive the tractor. I'm sure glad I didn't go off the cliff. Ah, that would have been too bad. for that direction. So do I get down there and then I have to go up there? start building a couple things and see how it goes.
<laughs> a little bit crazy. But a little bit more organized than usual. Hotkeys. My editor will criticize me again for not using my hotkeys. Sometimes I forget. Alright, I don't have enough iron plate with me. I gotta go back to my truck. Which means I need to find my truck. So, I'm going to go ahead and go offline right now. Found a water source, found a coal, coal mine right fairly close to it. It's in another location. I am not really thrilled about this location too much. Um, but I'm sure it'll be an interesting place to explore and see if I can... Uh, let me just pull the map over. What I'm thinking is that I'll be able to uh, look in this space over here. Now that I've got this power, uh, find a way to navigate from he from this part of the map over to this area that looks like it may be uh, fairly flat. Uh, and if it is, I'll be able to build the next platform and the next manufacturing place a little bit more organized right here. I have, you know, the coal mines that I'm using which are right here. And I can also then locate the coal mines that are up here. Uh, I've got uh, normal coal and normal coal. Both of those are normal. So uh, looks like I've got fairly close places that I could possibly look for, for coal. Okay, so in the peripheral, we've got copper ore and iron ore. And what do we have? <gasps> More iron ore here, okay. So if it isn't too steep getting over to here from here, um, I'll be able to find iron ore here and bring it into this area. So that's kind of what I'm planning, what I'm uh, looking at trying to do. We'll uh, try that again the next episode. Uh, I'm going to go find my uh, find my truck. So looking forward to, to working on this some more and seeing you again. So 
uh, hit the subscribe button if you're willing and uh, hit the like button if it's good enough and uh, we'll look forward to seeing you later. Thanks.